The metric system was introduced in France in 1791, and the majority of countries subsequently adopted the metric system as a common system of weights and measures. Since 1960, the metric system was known as the C system, which is short for Système International. This is the correct name for it. We in the UK began to move towards this system in 1965. It is now the most common system of weights and measures in the world, and most countries now use it. The only countries which do not follow this system are Burma, Liberia and the United States. A number of countries have laws which permit use of other systems of measurement. For example, here in the United Kingdom our traffic sign regulations only allow distances to be displayed using the imperial system, miles and yards. Other standardized measuring systems other than metric are still used internationally, such as nautical miles and knots in aviation. The metric system is a decimal system of physical units based on a unit of length known as the meter. The word meter comes from the Greek word metron, which means measure. Scientists created it to fit their needs, the system is logical and exact. It is standardized and simple and allows easy exchange of information. It follows the decimal number system, the units increase or decrease in size by multiples of 10. For example, one centimeter has 10 parts called millimeters. 100 centimeters makes up one meter. Because it works in decimals, it makes it easier to change one unit of measure into another by moving the decimal point. This was not the case with the imperial system, there were often complicated sums to be carried out to change units of measure, for example inches to feet, especially when it came to dealing with larger numbers. The basic units of the metric system, weight, milligrams, grams, kilograms, metric ton length, millimeters, centimeters, meters, kilometers volume, milliliters, cubic centimeters, liters, cubic meters, Area, square meters, hectares, square kilometers, 